Welcome! Are you ready to begin today's class? Excellent! So before we begin, I'm going to tell you what you need for today's activity, okay? So first, you're going to need, of course, your book. You're going to need a magazine to get some cutouts, okay? You're going to need an apron. But if you don't have an apron, you can use an old shirt, okay? A eraser, a sharpener, a pencil, a paintbrush, glue, glitter, red paint, and some good and dust, okay? All right, how about we watch a video to begin our daily routine. Ready? Was that good? Okay, but tell me guys, how do you feel today? Look, here on my wall, I have a sad face, a mad face, and a happy face. Tell me, how do you feel today? How are you? Good. I'm so happy that you guys are happy because Teacher Lucy feels really happy today. Excellent. Now, tell me, how was the weather? It's the weather rainy, it's a cloudy, or it's a sunny. Look through the window and tell me, how was the weather today? Excellent, today's weather is sunny. Very good, guys. So, to continue, let's review some words from the vocabulary animals yes farm animals okay so the first is gonna be rooster say it rooster very good and then we have cow cow very good then we have zip zip good then we have goat goat then we have hen, hen, very good. Then we have turkey, turkey. And the last, but not the least, is woos, woos. Very good, guys. Remember, once in a while, you need to study these vocabulary words, okay? Now, hello, guys. Hello. <laughs> we are farmers. And we're here to show you our little farm and the farm animals that you can find inside the red barn. Are you ready? Let's begin. Geraldine is going to show you the pig. That's the pig. Okay, you need to pay attention because you need to tell me what your favorite farm animal is. All right? Pay attention because you have to tell me what's your favorite farm animal. Good? All right. So she's going to show you all the different dogs that we have in the farm. Because on the farms, 
almost all the time we have a lot of dogs because they need to watch over the farm so nobody else gets inside and steals something from the farm let's show them the dogs that's a black dog a brown and beige dog another brown dog very good then we have a little cat it's white very good then we have some dogs it's a little white the other it's blue i don't know why but it's blue and then we have a little goose and it's black then we have let me show you inside the barn we have a hand then we have this little rooster and then inside we have the little baby it's a little chicken and then we have a horse And then also we have a cow. I don't know why my cow is red. I mean, yes, it is red. I don't know why, but it's red. And then we have its husband, the bull. Very good. Do you like the farm? Okay, tell me. What's your favorite farm animal? What's your favorite farm animal, Ayeradi? My favorite animal is a chicken. Very good. So you guys tell me, what's your favorite farm animal? All right. Now, let's open up your book on the yellow section, and we're going to work on the page, because you need to circle what your favorite farm animal is, okay? Excellent, guys. See you next time. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. Open the book on the yellow section, page 52. Got it? Yellow section 52. And it says, what I see in the farm. We can see some hen, cow, dogs, a goat, a sheep, a hen, chickens, another hen, a little rabbit, and the goat. Sorry, this was a sheep, not a goat. So, two sheep. Oh, I forgot the horse. Very good. And also, we see a, what's this, a house? Mm -mm. This is a barn. You can see it's all white. You need to color the barn with red. Let's use red for the side walls, brown for the door and the ceiling roof, okay? Let's begin. You can do a better nice job. Maybe I'm not doing it too good because I have to do it really fast and really quick, but you need to do really really good okay all right guys remember write your name on the homework all right he has some hay showing once you're done coloring the farm you need to search your favorite farm do you remember the geraldines Favorite farm animal was the chicken. So, my favorite farm animal, it's the horse. What's yours? Remember, you need to circle your favorite farm animal. And when you're finished, write your name in the picture and send that to your corresponding. All right? Very good. All right, guys. Now it's time to do our craft activity. All right? Good, 
So please open your book on the purple section, page 47. Purple section 47, which is this page. You can see, what do you see? Is this a farm or a barn? What is this? Exactly, this is a barn. Very good. Can you see the color? It looks brown in here, but we also going to color the barn with red, okay? As, the same as you did on the other page, on the yellow section page, remember? So we're going to color the barn with red. All right, let's begin. At the beginning of the class, I told you that you need an apron so you don't get your shirt or your clothes dirty. So if you don't have your apron, you can use an old shirt, but it has to be old something that you don't need anymore, okay? Because then it's gonna be all stained with paint. Okay, I'm gonna put it up. So, once I have it on, I'm going to begin with my barn. Now that I got my apron on, I'm going to begin with my activity, okay? Good, so first, I'm gonna use the glue and then the wooden dust. Okay, once again, if you don't have the wooden dust, you can use, sharpen your color or your pencil and use it. Okay, I'm going to be showing you how this needs to look. Alright guys, let's do this fast. Very good. This is looking okay. Let me do it on my tip. After you're finished, you need to clean up, okay? Do not leave a mess. You see? It's looking pretty. Now, you see the flowers in here? Use colors for those flowers. Color them. Color them really nice. Use different colors. Purple, yellow, pink, orange, but not green, because we're going to do something for the grass. Okay, in these cases, if you don't have this green wooden dust, you can use some uh, leaves and paste them. I got dry leaves, but these are dry. If you go like this and smash them, it's going to look like grass, so they're going to be really good, okay? Once again, I'm going to use glue. Let me put the book on the table so it's better and easier for me. Alright, I'm going to use my finger. 
to spread the glue. Okay, now put the green on dust. I'm gonna fry it because that's gonna be the crust. Okay. Very good. So it's gonna look like this. Woohoo! One more thing, guys, okay? Let me show you. If you decide or you already chose what's your favorite farm animal, you can paste it right here. Let me show you how. At the beginning of the class, I ask you to have a magazine. Good, we're going to get some magazine cutouts. You need to look for farm animals. Look, I have a hand, horses, and a cow. You decide what your favorite farm animal is, and you paste it on the door or in the front of the barn, okay? Oops. Exactly like this, because that's my favorite farm animal. You see? So we have our page all done and finished. Use a pencil to write your name. Okay, guys? Once again, remember, when all the work is finished, take a picture and send it to your corresponding teacher. If your teacher it's Teacher Honey, take the picture and send it to Teacher Honey. But if I'm, if I'm your teacher, take the picture and send it to me. I'll be happy to see it. Okay, guys? Remember, send the picture to you corresponding teacher. All right, guys? Very good. Well, that's it, guys. It's pretty easy, right? We learn about farm animals and about a little place that we find inside a farm, which is the barn. Excellent. Very good, guys. Well, I have nothing else to say, but thank you. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye-bye, guys. Thank you for everything.